tell you why I love you. Cause he is the truth. Said he is so real. And I love the way that he makes me feel. Hey. And if I am a reflection of him. Hi guys, okay, I'm in the same clothes because I did two videos in once again because I've told you already, it makes life so much easier. So So yeah. Um, yeah, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking about um, being in a relationship with a Christian. As you all probably know, I'm a Muslim, born and raised Muslim. Um, I'm an East African Muslim, so yeah. Um, so being in a relationship with a Christian, like people try to make it seem like it's like it's hard. It's not hard. <laughs> Maybe it's not that hard because I'm not that religious. Maybe because of that, but I don't think it's hard. Um, yeah, I just feel like being in a relationship because we're both such. Me and my boyfriend are both such spiritual people, so like we believe in energy and like just positive vibes and stuff. Do you know what I mean? Like we be, we believe we. Be, believe so much in energy and vibe and being spiritually connected and stuff so um yeah I just feel like it's not as hard as I said it's probably because I'm not um a very religious Muslim um however I did tell my parents about my boyfriend obviously because I'm gonna marry his ass or he gonna marry me fucking me <laughs> but yeah <laughs> But yeah, I did tell my parents about him. Um, so yeah, I called my dad and I was like, uh, to my dad, oh, I want you to meet someone. And he was like, he, I, can't, I think he knew that it was a boy, obviously. And then um, I was like, yeah, I was like, he's my boyfriend, blah, blah, blah. Just telling him his background, where he's from, etc. And then my dad asked, is he a Muslim? And I was like, no. And then... Um, my dad was upset for like 10 minutes <laughs> he was upset he was like oh, um like we had a little argument on the phone because obviously i live in london they live in um, amsterdam well they don't live in Am they live in holland in Deventer. so um yeah so he was upset but he got over it so then um yeah he was like as long as you're happy Blah, blah blah, I'd love to meet him, etc. So, my and that's why I'm like, I'm so thankful for my parents. My parents are not, they're not so sh like they care so much about their children that they won't disobey their children because their partner is Christian. Because there's a lot of Muslim parents that would be like, no, boom, that's it's a no go. Do you know what I mean? But, um, yeah, I, I'm so thankful for them. So, um they did speak in the end and all my, yeah, all my dad said to him, they were actually started talking about football because my dad is a full on football head and so is my boyfriend. So I was like, they've got something in common. Hallelujah, amen. <laughs> so um, yeah, so then they just started talking about football and he was like, oh, don't you keep her happy, blah, blah, blah etc. So yeah, like, I'm so like I'm so thankful for my parents. Honestly, like my parents are they don't judge me. <laughs> Thank you, mom and dad, for not judging me. Like honestly, like they let me be who I want to be. Do you know what I mean? They let me make mistakes by myself, etc. So I'm so thankful for them. Like and my parents do. They are like religious. They do. Um, yeah, they are religious, obviously, because being an East African, like East African Muslims are very, they are very religious. But yeah, my um, parents are religious. My brother, especially, 
he's very religious <laughs> he went to egypt was it egypt yeah he went to egypt i think he, he he's still there um to learn more to learn more about the dean um so he's all like no tv no nothing like he's full-on strict muslim i don't think he doesn't know that i've got a christian boyfriend <laughs> Um, I think if he didn't know, he wouldn't come to my wedding. But at the end of the day, this is the person I'm in love with. Like, I see myself with this guy for the rest of my life. So, do you know what I mean? Sometimes you just got. Sometimes it's just life, isn't it? Like, it's a part of life. I don't really talk to my brother that much, anyways, because obviously he's a very religious person, so he judges me. Um, so I don't really talk to him. I haven't spoken to him for quite a while. But, um, yeah, so that's like, I'm just a very thankful, happy person. Um, my boyfriend's side of the family, they know, I think they know I'm Muslim, but either way, it doesn't really make a difference because, like, I don't look like a Muslim, quote, quote. What I mean by that is I don't have a headscarf on, etc., etc. So, but yeah, I love them. They're, they're cool. So, yeah, like, it's, I don't find it hard, but if you are in a relationship um, and your boyfriend is a Christian and you've got issues, I'd love to hear from down below and I'd love to give you some advice because it was quite easy for me, but obviously it wasn't that easy. Um, so, yeah, that's just my story about me be me falling in love with a christian <laughs> that's what i'm gonna capture it catching it me and muslim falling in love with a christian because that's what happened so yeah um so that's it really that's just me explaining that not all in like not all how do i say it not all like religions clash do you know what i mean like well, thank God for my family because I am, like, they are very, like, accepting. So they, they accepted the fact that he wasn't um, a Muslim. So, yeah. So, yeah, my boyfriend's a very caring person. Caring, loving, just supports me in everything I do. Couldn't ask for anyone better. I'd love to hear all your comments down below and thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! <laughs> and here's the things I don't like about him are fine with me Cause my heart's a need to understand him cause he's so much like me It's truly my pleasure to share his company <laughs> And I know that it's God's gift to breathe the air he breathes